Good morning, guys. Welcome to language class. A paragraph is our topic for today. Copy, please. A paragraph. Time to copy. What is a paragraph? A paragraph is a group of sentences. Group of sentences. Remember that a sentence is a group of words. A group of words that tells a complete thought or idea. Because a group of words could be a uh, food, paper, pencil, table, boy. That's a group of words, but I didn't say anything. They are not related. They don't make sense. So paragraph is a group of sentences that tells about one subject or area. A group of sentences that tells about one subject or area. It's time to copy. Are you copying, Maria Jose? Ha huh, ha, huh. you're not. Each sentence in a paragraph in a paragraph must give information about the topic. Information about the topic. You need to identify the main idea in a paragraph. The main idea, the main idea, it's a sentence, a sentence that talks about the topic in a general way. That's the main idea, in a general way. The rest of the sentences in the paragraph give us details, details about the topic. But the main idea is one sentence that tells you about the topic in a general way. That's the main idea. That's the main idea, okay? Isabella, oh, Isabella is in the bathroom, right? Miss, I finished Santiago. Excellent, Santiago. Miss, I finished to copy. Okay. Okay, guys. Remember, let me remember. Let's remember what a paragraph is. A paragraph is made up of sentences in plural. One sentence is not a paragraph. A group of sentences made up a paragraph. A paragraph should have at least five sentences, at least, okay, five sentences. A paragraph has a topic sentence or main idea. Topic sentence or main idea. Each sentence relates to, to a single idea about the main topic. Paragraph, explain or describe something. A paragraph has a topic sentence or main idea, supporting sentences or details, and a concluding sentence, okay? A concluding sentence. If you're gonna talk about your vacation, you, are going, you can write down a paragraph. You can write down a paragraph, okay? You said, oh, my last summer vacations were the best. That's a main idea. And in a general way, you, you say what the paragraph is about. About your last vacation. Okay, let's watch the video. I have the video ready. I have the video ready here. Okay, guys, so it's time to practice. This is the worksheet you have to do online. It has paragraph. Look at the first one. Did you ever, of oh, the instruction says, did you ever wonder what people did for ice before refrigerators were invented? Oh, interesting. How did people make or keep drinking drinks? Um, Drinks uh, frozen, maybe not frozen, but cold. 
How did they keep Why is his main idea? Cold? Okay, wait. They cut huge blocks of ice from frozen lakes and rivers in winter. Then they store this ice in, in shacks called ice houses. These were built in the coolest, shadiest places around. What are you looking at, Diego? You're not looking at the class? The ice usually lasted all summer. This is incredible. So they created, this house was a kind of refrigerator because imagine that they caught huge pieces of ice and then they keep it in a special house and that ice lasted for lasted all summer this is incredible so that house was a kind of refrigerator what do you think i think that is the b you think that is the letter b mm -hmm. i lost another student yes. you have not seen the link. No, I haven't shared the link. So the paragraph tells mainly, what is this paragraph about? Lo how long the ice lasted, how refrigerators were invented, how people once kept ice. The C, the C, the C. I think the C. So you click on the C. So you have three options and you can tell me what this paragraph is about. Mainly what this paragraph is about mainly about so let me share let me share uh, the link with you now in the chat and this is gonna be for everyone in the meeting there click there because your worksheet are your points today so click there click there and let's do the worksheet together are you ready did you open the worksheet yeah, yeah. yeah. click there click in the worksheet i want all of you ready to work with me and i have two cameras off it is it has camera off and and Alan has camera some people off. using phone and why they touch touch to enter the camera turns off. Mm -hmm. Okay. People in, in computer you can put it in small but in phone no. Uh huh. Or in iPad. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Ready? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm writing some things here. I almost finished. Okay. Something that I need. Uh, are you ready? So the number two is the number one. The answer is letter C, right? Because it's this. Um, that's what we think, right? That this paragraph, this paragraph talks about um, how people once kept ice. The number two, one of the world's strangest creatures is the mind bird. The strangest creature. It can imitate the human voice far better than a parrot can. Wow. Have you heard that before? That this bird can imitate human voice better than a parrot. Have you ever heard that? I have ever heard about this kind of bird. That's why it says that it's a very strange creature. It's the strangest creature in the world. A wild minor will also imitate the songs or sounds of other birds. It can do this so well that it even confuses these other birds. The paragraph tells mainly how many birds the mina imitates, what makes the mina strange, 
that the parrot can imitate? A, B, or C. What do you think? A, B, or C. How many birds the mina imitate? What makes the mina strange? And what the parrot can imitate? And I think how many birds the mania mania uh, that the bird imitates. I think we need to consider the something. The bee. The bee. Okay, we need to consider something. The main idea about the, about this paragraph it's at the beginning, and the main idea says one of the worst strangest creature is the mina bird. So I even what happens if you choose another word? You're gonna have a fail. Oh, he's he turns so, red. So um uh, I'm just two more and never mind. Three more and we finish. <laughs> yes, it's a very short. Uh -huh. So I yes, I think it's the letter B because the main idea says mentioned that mina is the worst stranger creature. So this paragraph, wait, wait, Jose Enrique, this paragraph that's, that's, probably that it, it tell us what things this bird make that make made us that make it the strange, the strangest creature in the world. Yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Tell me. Uh, I'm going to a doctor. I get out of the class. Who's telling me that? Diego, Diego. right? Diego. Yes. Uh, okay, Diego. Thank you. I'm going to see the class. That's okay. Bye bye. Enrique? I already finished the worship. I okay. Really? But let me finish this with the rest of the students. Can you imagine your male career will candy with can you imagine your male career with candy books and small tools to sell? Male careers of long ago often bought and sold things as they delivered mail. This often made the male careers late. That's why Benjamin Franklin stopped this buying and selling by male careers. So this paragraph is about how Benjamin Franklin felt about selling, how early careers spent time on, on their mail routes, where carriers bought the candy. What is this about? The B. The B. You said the letter B? Yes. It makes B. sense. Because it says, how, can you imagine your mail career with candy books and small tools to sell? Uh -huh. Please. Please. Oh, never mind. Because it was only in the four. You don't put me on one answer, but there are the other two here. Yeah. Okay. Number four, because it's late. The Native Americans of long ago carried a widespread trading with other with each other. Alligator teeth, teeth from Florida have been found in Native American burial mounds in las tumbas. In los entierros that from Native Americans found were, were found alligator teeth. In Illinois, volcanic rock from Yellowstone Park in Wyoming has been found in the burial mounds of Ohio. So the paragraph tells what Native Americans put in burial mounds, how widely the Native Amer Americans traded, why Native Americans traded alligator teeth. The B. The B. The Native yes. Americans of Loma go carry a widespread trade with each other. Yes. Okay, B. Have you ever seen an skateboard park? There are many of them around the country. Each skateboard you touch park. C. You touch C. Winding course that includes slopes and banks. If you say B, you touch C. B. Okay, thank you. To be sure, to be sure safety, park operators make skateboard riders wear helmets. A helmet is a is a casco. Where skateboards park around 
what skateboard parks sí. are like sí. operators sí. skateboard parks. Gabi. So sí. have you ever seen a skateboard park? So probably they are this one. The other sentences are the, uh, well you're gonna you're not gonna send it because you're the teacher. Or you're gonna know uh, you're not gonna send it because you're the teacher. Yeah, I will. But I will, I can. No problem. This is this is the code. H Q M Touch and say if the answers are correct. Okay, I am gonna send the code in the chat so you can copy Me, from there. We already have a copy yes, ten of here. ten. You got ten out of ten? Whoa. Yes. So we answer it correctly. There's yep. touch, send, and check all the answers if they're correct. Mm -hmm. Let me see what it says here. Accept that. So check the evaluation, up if you got it correct. The evaluation is ooh, 10 hours. Oh, wait. I'm going to send it because I. Yes, yeah, send it to me. This is the evaluation again. So look what I've received. I received this one. Uh, hey, Miss, said, can you please uh, uh, volver a mandar el link because I don't have it. You don't have it. Okay. Yeah. You can improve your grade. Miss, you I, have, again. I have 10 of 10. 10 out of 10. Okay. Again, listen. I said that you can send you can do it again <coughs> if you want to improve your grade si quiere mejorar su nota because i see that there are some grades that are low Miss, how, how is my grade oh. uh, adriana six out of ten santiago perfect maria jose perfect isabella perfect. Me, miss. Has eight out of ten daniel oh, is you. perfect it is Eight out of ten. Yes, can I, I can I close the page. Jose Sebastian. Yes, can I close the page? Perfect. Yes, you can. Melanie got a perfect grade. Daniel, eight out of ten. Okay, what I do now? Kristen, six out of ten. Um, Someone got two out of. Jose, Jose oh, Hernandez, perfect. Alan, six out of ten. Oh. Hazel has two out of ten. So Hazel, you can do it again in order to improve your grade. Yeah, and send it again. You have to do it and send it again. Okay? So you can send it again. How many How many we are connected? 16. So I lost kids. So if you got a grade, a good grade, you can dismiss the class. If you want to do it again, in order to Bye improve me. your grade, you can Bye try it again. Bye-bye. See you after lunch. Bye bye, Miss. Bye bye. Thank you. It is. Bye, Miss. I love you. I love you too. I'm gonna see. Uh -huh. But send the, send the worksheet. Send oh, the, I don't send that. <laughs> Sorry. Send it. Send it. Because the evaluations is in this worksheet. I know that I miss Maria Jose. I miss. Uh, no, Alan is here. Swag. I haven't received swag. Um, you need to miss. Crystal, I think he's missing too. I 10 out of 10 miss. Okay, Crystal. Miss, I have 10 out of 10 miss. Yes. Okay. You you did it again? Me, me too. I have 10 of 10. 10 out of 10? And yeah, Miss. Crystal, Daniel. Uh -huh. Okay. Bye, Miss. Bye bye. bye, bye. Don't forget to send the to send the worksheet. Send it. I am waiting for it, Maria Fernanda. Okay. Don't forget to send it because the points are in that worksheet for this class. Okay. Enjoy your meal. See you later.